New at noon, it is finally here. This year's Tony Award nominations are out as Broadway celebrates its best. Entertainment reporter Sandy Canyon here with more on this morning's announcement. Sandy. Dave Mariah Carey gets her first Tony nomination as one of the producers of Some Like It Hot, which earned the most Tony nods, a total of 13. Elsewhere on the list, it's Ben Platt versus Josh Groban in one category, Jessica Chastain versus Jodie Comer in another. These are just two of the races that will be closely watched before the trophies are given out in mid-June. The Love Letter to Our City was one of five musicals nominated as the year's best, and they vary widely in tone from the more traditional like New York, New York, and Some Like It Hot, inspired by the classic movie, to a show like Kimberly Akimbo about a high school student who is aging rapidly. I like the way you look at life and think outside the box. And Juliet offers an alternative to Shakespeare's traditional tale. What if Juliet didn't kill herself? Shucked is set in rural America. Among the plays, one I especially enjoyed, a revival of Death of a Salesman, earned a Tony nod for Wendell Pierce. You can't eat the orange and throw the peel away. A man is not a piece of fruit. Today's announcement brought more good news for Audra McDonald, a performer who has already won more competitive Tony Awards than anyone else. Ohio State Murders earned her another nomination. For a long time, nobody knew who the killer was. Jessica Chastain is celebrating her first Tony nomination for A Doll's House. Sarah Bareilles earned her first as the baker's wife who goes into the woods. There's the answer if you're clever. For all the recognition of the revivals, the future of Broadway wasn't overlooked. <laughs> what a mighty God we serve. <laughs> Ain't No Mo earned a nod for best play despite its run that was, in my opinion, way too brief. Complete list of all this year's Tony nominations can be found on our website, ABC7NY. The Tony Awards will be given out on Sunday, June 11th. Damon Shirley.